Hey there, what is up? Welcome back again for another product review and testing. It is Deep Cool Gamax GT Tough Gaming. This cooler is only compatible with Asus Aura Sync and Razer Chroma. But this one has the tough color accents. The packaging is good and I would say that the box is thick. So I recently bought a CPU, a Ryzen 5 3600. As a first time Ryzen user, I was surprised on how hot the CPU gets. So I ordered an aftermarket cooler immediately. Okay, so now let's proceed in the testing. For the test, I will use Cinebench R20 and I will be running the multi-core test. Temperatures at idle for 30 minutes will also be recorded. And these are our final results. Based on our results, we can see that just by installing the cooler, we already have a significant decrease in the temperature. So the Ryzen 5 3600 has a rated mass temperature of 95 degrees Celsius. So we can see that using the stock cooler, when we run Cinebench 20, we are reaching the maximum temperatures, thus we are experiencing throttling. After installing the aftermarket cooler, we can also see that we have a slight increase in our Cinebench score. So the cooler prevented thermal throttling and it, it gave us a better score. I, I, I also recorded the change in temperature here, you can see that 30. This data tells us the, the efficiency of the cooler in eliminating the heat. An aftermarket cooler usually has a bigger heat sink than the stock coolers. So a lesser change in temperature means that our cooler is much more efficient in dissipating the heat. Okay, so as a conclusion, this aftermarket is a good option if you are building on a budget. You should take we should also take note that the CPU is ran on stock speeds, no overclocking was done in the testing, but given the cooler's idle and under load temperatures, it would make a little room for an overclock. So if you are also a Ryzen user, specifically the 3rd gen, and you are doing CPU heavy works like video editing and 3D rendering, I would recommend you buying an aftermarket cooler based on the testing that we have done today. And as always, thank you so much for watching. If you like my videos, make sure to leave a like. If you don't like my vids, you can dislike it as well. And if you haven't already, make sure to leave a subscribe. Thank you and I will see you again next time.